वेलकम फ्रेंड्स सो दिस इज अनदर क्वेश्चन ऑफ द डे प्रॉब्लम टुडे आई पोस्टेड दिस क्वेश्चन विच इज द नंबर वन थ्रू ट्वेंटी आर रिटन इन रो नाउ टू प्लेयर्स टेक टर्न पुटिंग प्लस साइंस एंड माइनस साइंस बिटवीन द नंबर वेन ऑल सच साइंस हैव बीन प्लेस्ड द रिजल्टिंग एक्सप्रेशन इज इवेलुएटेड दैट इज एडिशन एंड सब्ट्रैक्शन आर परफॉर्म द फर्स्ट प्लेयर विन्स इफ द सम इज इवन एंड द सेकेंड विन्स इफ द सम इज ऑड सो द क्वेश्चन इज हु विल विन एंड हाउ Now I have written these twenty numbers, uh, not in a row, but you know, in two rows. But I have also shown some boxes where pluses or minus sign has to be placed. Now let us say the first person, you know, uh, uh, puts this here. Let us say plus sign between five and six, and the second person puts minus sign like that. And then again, again, you know, uh, the first person puts minus here. and the second person plus puts plus here and likewise he does it so we have to find out who will win and uh, the player who uh, wins if the sum is even and second player wins wins if the sum is odd now if you see if you put any uh, how many even numbers are there here there are 10 even numbers so basically there are 10 even numbers and 10 odd numbers 10 odd numbers isn't it now if you have 10 odd numbers then uh so let's take let's take case by case 10 even numbers are nothing but 2 4 6 8 10 likewise till 20 and uh, 10 odd numbers are 1 3 5 7 likewise till 19 right now if you put any so basically what will happen there will be either a plus sign or a minus sign in front of in all these digits isn't it let us say for example when this guy was placing some sign between 15 and 16 so he has two choices either he will put plus 16 or he will put minus 16 right so hence we can say that uh, along with all the numbers present here there will be either a plus sign or a minus sign okay so now let us take the case of even numbers now whether there is a plus sign ahead of 2 4 6 8 10 or a minus sign the result of all this sum together will always be even why because even plus even is even even plus even is equal to even and even minus even is also even isn't it now come to the odd part of this so odd odd numbers are 1 3 5 7 now again there will these numbers will be associated with either plus or minus sign now we have 10 odd numbers so basically 10 odd numbers are there 10 odd numbers are there that means i have five pairs of five pairs of odd numbers isn't it five pairs of odd numbers now if there are pairs of odd numbers so whether whether two odd numbers are added or subtracted the result is always even right so odd plus odd is equal to even and odd minus odd is also even right and there are five such pairs so there will be five even numbers isn't it so we saw, we saw in case 1 also there are the result is even so hence in case 1 there will be the result is even when this is nothing but all even numbers when all even numbers were considered the the sum or the or the difference the total that is the calculation calculated value will be even and when all odd numbers were considered then also there is a result of even right so even number is the result now even plus and again minus either even the uh, add, adding the two even numbers and adding the or subtracting the two even numbers you will again get a even number isn't it so hence what do we see irrespective of wherever the signs are put the result will always be even why again sum or differences of 10 even numbers will always result into a even number similarly sum and differences of 10 odd numbers or five pairs of even number uh, odd numbers sorry will always result in a even number so hence even plus minus even is even isn't it so food for thought for you will be what if 
we instead of taking first 20 20 numbers we would have taken let us say first 21 numbers that is after 20 we had 21 also then who would have won this is for you to do as an exercise thank you